Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Mad Tea Party. We hope you're ready to spill the tea. If you're returning, thank you so much for coming back. And if you're new to our channel, my name is Derek. And my name is Ryan. And today we feel fancy. Yeah, we're getting formal today for Disneyland Paris. Um, We are formal today for Disneyland Paris pins. We are formal today because we're introducing our brand new uh, webcam that looks better to me. And our new lighting. And also, we went to a gala tonight. So yeah. we decided that we wanted to show Let's be honest. We would not have put cuteness. on a tie for this. No. no Love no. y'all. So much, but not for, not a, tie. for a tie. Um, but today we do have a special delivery. The lovely Karen over at Karen's USA Adventures or Enchanted Mysteries. Both are amazing. She is a doll. Yeah, Truly, she is. And she will take care of you. And she literally, I think this is three or four orders. And she's just like, I'll hold on to it to save you, save you shipping. Yeah. I'll hold on to it. And she always does as well. We just kept adding things. And then actually, once the order was complete, I then emailed one more time. Hey, can you add this one more thing in there? Just one more. Um, so in this box, I can only think of one thing that I remember. Oh, no, I think I remember more of it now. One is from a live sale. She was walking around Disneyland Paris, and she had her camera, and we we saw things, and we were able to be like, I want that. I want that. That feels like forever ago. It was, It literally was forever ago. So That's let's so dig into these. <laughs> All right, so we're jumping in. Woo! Peanuts! These packing peanuts are fun. Um, nobody has these. These are, I think Disneyland Paris boxes from Enchanted Mysteries are the only ones we can Yeah. Out. Oh, okay. I'm going to the bottom because there's always, and as the peanuts fall out, there's always candy. Oh, and they're the squishies. I believe these are the marshmallow. Um, Yum. Marshmallow? Were the they? drumstick. Drumstick squishies, and they are raspberry and milk flavored. That says squashy. Oh, it's totally squashy. <laughs> It's like something that was squashed. Um, they look delicious. Do we taste them now? Um, we can open one bag and we'll taste them. All right. That was satisfying. Definitely marshmallow. So good. I think, right? Mmm. What is it? I'm a fan. Yeah. Marshmallow. It's kind of it has like a. It's like a fruity marshmallow. It also taffy. has like a taffy. Yeah. It's like a cross between a marshmallow and a taffy. Have you guys ever had squashies? Because I am. These are delicious. We recommend. We recommend. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and do this one first. He's wrapped individually because he's the one I tossed in towards the end, um, which means he is probably the most recently released. Oh, I didn't know he was coming in this order. I thought it was a separate order. Oh, yeah. It's See, crazy. Karen also has things in stock. Mm -hmm. If she know, she knows what people like, and she will have them in stock ready in case someone needs something like this. It's so pretty. Oh. Y'all, yeah, they're pins. Oh, my gosh. So this pin, this is another, a new favorite, one of my new favorite Disneyland Paris pins. Every time we get one of these boxes, I'm like, it's my new favorite. So we have here this adorable Mad Hatter. He looks so good. I really like the size of this pin, the addition of the teacup, teacups and the teapots around him. Um, this series, they released a couple of them. This was the only one I really needed. The other ones looked a lot like um, other pins that I had or pins I had seen, whereas this one felt completely new. The other ones were all very similar to yeah, the other Yeah, a things. lot of them come out and they look the same. Like, there's a lot of similar... Especially with movies like Atlas that they release a lot for, it's, I'm sure, hard for them to constantly be pumping out different things. I get it. Um, but, I love this pen. Um, also in the bottom was a nice little card. Thank you for your order. If you're happy with the service, please share on social media. Done. Done and done. We've included an extra card to share with friends. Got done. it right here. Uh, thank you again, Karen and the team. XXX. Karen and that team are amazing. Disneyland Paris pickups, baby. So this is the Paris pickups. They also have mystery boxes that you can get. 
that range all sorts of prices and you can do pins only, you can do merch, you can do something where you can pick like a spirit jersey plus certain things. So many different mixes, Marvel only. To just check her out. We will We've link done them several down below. of those. Yeah, we'll link those videos so you can watch them. But we love the mystery box. Yeah. We're never disappointed by those either. Never. All right. Well, the first one that's ready. So the exciting thing about this pin is, I think I now have every pin from this little series that was released. This was the last one I needed to finish it. Here we have Briar Rose. She's so pretty. She is. Um, I love her so much. I have the one from this set. Like, there's so many. There's the pink and blue dress from this set. The one where she's Prince the Philip pink dress. or the uh, animals dancing yeah, around I have that in, one too. in the cave. I'll have to look, but I think this is the last one. Beautiful. I think it is. All right, I am going to open one. And, oh, I love that these are all different colors, and I don't remember what their pricings are for these colors, but it's funny because I just looked at them all, and they're about the same size. But this next one was from our second order, and just wait till you see it. It's so cute. He is so wonderful. There is baby Pegasus and baby Hercules. I have a pin that is similar to this. It's actually one of my favorite pins, and this is like a larger version of it with more detail almost. Mm -hmm. It's gorgeous. It's so pretty. And she made sure, she said Disneyland Paris does not get much Hercules at all. Oh, yeah. So she said when they started these, she said even though they're open edition, if you want them, get them now because- I'm on it. This one is yours right here. This old one. That old one right there! Hey, I feel like I'm dressed in theme for this one. This feels like something. Okay. Here we have the Valentine's Day Lumi hair. Um, I spotted him on a rack while she was shopping in one of the pin stores in Disneyland Paris. And was like, gimme, gimme, gimme! Um, this set is really pretty. I ha We have the white rabbit from this set. But, you know, I just love my boy Lumi hair. If you didn't know... <laughs> huh? Yeah. I played Lumi hair once in... You did? <laughs> So with that, I am going to show you the next Hercules pin that I got because it's... There's our boy, Baby Pegasus, just prancing on along. He's so cute. And just to give you an idea, he is pretty, pretty tall. Mm -hmm. There are always, always great size pins in Paris. That's the best thing about Paris pins is they're normally pretty big. I would like to go back to Paris one day so we can actually look at their pens and get some for ourselves. Yeah, we didn't collect pens when we went there. Sad day. Sad day. All right, well, Ryan had the first two, so I'm gonna get the last two. This next one is also for my Hercules collection. So here is Mr. Huncules and Megara. Now, I have started collecting more pins of of Hercules, but normally they have to have Meg too. I really like Megara, and I do like Hercules. He's a babe. He is, and I have some really good pins, but I've decided that she was missing from my collection, so I need to add more of her. That's true. And this is part of the reason why I was like, I need Meg. She's a great her. character. And finally, um, this one is a, um, I was about to say it's a double pin, but it's not. It's a double pin back. And this, I do believe, is from their fall collection because of the backer card, but also what they're doing. So here are Chip and Dale, and they are carding along some peanuts. Mm -hmm. And I'm not going to lie, when we bought this, I actually thought it was a Christmas one because I thought it was him pulling a sleigh. Oh, but I'm pretty sure that this is from actually one of the cartoons. I feel like I remember an episode where they are collecting nuts and they are like dragging each other around in a, it's like a wheelbarrow almost. Super, and it's, y'all, it's it's like palm length. Yeah. It's a really pretty pen. 
big, too. Thank you, Karen. Yes, once again, Karen, you have come through. Um, please check her out, guys, Enchanted Mysteries. You can look at her on Instagram. Um, Literally, it all down below. anything that you want in the Paris parks, she will pick up. She does have a shopper's fee, and it is very minimal. And the shipping is, it surprises me every time we get something, because the shipping is so cheap. Yeah. In my opinion. I also highly recommend joining the Facebook group because yes. it's a lot easier. She posts um, pins and stuff up there and goes live on there. and She's just kind of great. She's amazing. As always, thank you so much for watching. If you happen to be curious about our content, make sure to click on the subscribe button down below. Or off with your head. And if you enjoyed our video, which we hope you did, please you know you get, did. you know, give us a thumbs up. Yeah, please. And um, leave us a comment down below. Let us know which of our pins today was your favorite that came all the way from Paris. Which was your favorite? I think that it is the Pegasus strutting his stuff. Because I don't have... I have one that's like the baby Pegasus and Hercules, which is adorable. Mm -hmm. But I really like the one of him who's he's just like... Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, I think my favorite my favorite is definitely the Mad Hatter with all the teapots. Yeah. It's just so pretty. And make sure to comment down below what your favorite pin was and why was it Baby Hercules? Not just kidding. No, I bet it was Linnea. It could have been Chip and Dale, though. All right, we don't need to relist them. They lived it. <laughs> they lived it. They were here. Y'all, thank you all so much for watching, and we hope you have a golden afternoon. Bye, guys. Bye. See you later. If you don't care for tea, you can at least make polite conversation.